if you've been following the news recently, you've probably been hearing a lot about the government shutdown, and you might have even heard it's causing delays at airports. Well, things like this, um, they always get me to thinking. You know, I'm getting older, and uh, sometimes I look around me, and I don't even recognize the world I'm living in anymore. <laughs> things are changing, and not always for the better. And times like these, it's just <laughs> nice to sit down and talk about how things were a bit more simple back in my day. Back in my day, we didn't have government shutdowns causing delays at the airport. No, sir, back in my day, the delays were caused because the guy in front of you in the security line forgot to take off his rodeo belt with the giant buckle. And hey, Tex, you might want to take off your spurs, too. Back in my day, the Oscars... The Oscars didn't have trouble finding a host. Back in my day, they just called Billy Crystal. And if he couldn't host, there were no Oscars. In fact, some nights, if you're, if you're real quiet and you listen very hard, they say you can still hear Billy Crystal hosting an Oscars out there somewhere. <laughs> Good singer, Billy. Back in my day, we didn't have people putting on blindfolds and doing the bird box challenge. Horse feathers! Back in my day, if you were putting on a blindfold, it was to do the Fifty Shades of Grey challenge where you asked your wife to do scenes from the movie with you, but then when you put the blindfold on, she just left. And you ended up groping around an empty room and knocking over a lamp. <gasps> What's that, Rusty? You did, you did the cat box challenge? What's that? <gasps> oh, that's disgusting, Rusty. <laughs> Back in my day, we weren't afraid to eat romaine lettuce because we thought we'd get E. coli and die. Heck no. Back in my day, we were afraid to eat romaine lettuce because lettuce sucks. I mean... Who the hell would just eat lettuce for no reason? Lunatics and hippies, that's who. Rusty, what would you say if I gave you a big bowl of lettuce? I gotta be honest, Rusty, if your two options of bark and growl, I was betting on growl. Uh, little late, Rusty. That's a lot. Well, I'm gonna stop improvising with you. day we weren't liking pictures of eggs on Instagram. Cod swallow. Back in my day, we were getting a little tipsy and liking pictures of our ex-girlfriends on Instagram. Then we were getting on Google and searching for how to unlike a photo on Instagram. And after that, how to delete your Instagram account. Back in my day, sales of Apple products weren't dropping for the first time in 16 years. Come again? No, back in my day, the only Apple products being dropped were every pair of AirPods that were ever bought directly onto the floor of a subway car where they would roll right into a pool of something that, if it wasn't pee, was worse. <laughs> Back in my day, NASA wasn't reporting that Saturn was losing its rings. Back in my day, the only thing a Saturn was losing was its hubcaps. <laughs> because a Saturn is a piece of <laughs> car. Back in my day, Michael Cohen wasn't covering up Donald Trump's dirty deeds. Pish posh. Back, pish posh. It's worth saying again. Back in my day, the only dirty deeds being covered was the ACDC song, Dirty Deeds, by one of our late night writers, Brian Donaldson, at karaoke after he was seven scotches deep. 
And much like Billy Crystal, they say, at night, if you listen real close, you can still hear him singing it. Daddy Deeds! Thunder Cheek! Daddy Deeds! Thunder Cheek! Daddy Deeds! Thunder Cheek! Daddy Deeds and the Thunder Cheek! Well, I'm sorry I had to do that, but sometimes as grumpy Gramps has got a gripe. This has been back in my day.